Warren, three changes your squad to face South Africa. Talk us through those um, decisions first of all. Well, forced on us really in terms of uh, the injury to George North with the concussion. And then obviously uh, Paul James and uh, Richard Hibbard going back to their English clubs as well. So players have been pretty battered uh, during the first half of the week. And that's why we delayed, delayed naming the team in, until the Thursday. But players, uh, we had given them Tuesday afternoon and Wednesday off. And, They've come back fresh, and um, you know, fortunately, we've got players available to us to to select what we think is a pretty strong side. Apart from those three and four changes, there's a very, very consistent feel and experienced feel to that squad now, isn't there? Yeah, and it was it was important to do that. That's why you know we took a bit of extra time because I think it was the Monday or the Tuesday we had something like ten or eleven players that couldn't take a part in training, not because there were serious injuries, because but because they had knocks and really needed two or three days just to recover from. Uh, you know, the physical battering that was was out there on Saturday and I think uh, you know it was very intense, it was very physical last week and the body just needed a few days to recover. As you said it was a huge effort last weekend, what are you looking for today in training and for the match on Saturday? Well just really for the guys to, to um, energy is important, uh, um, obviously the guys were disappointed but you know to sort of put that behind them to focus on South Africa and uh, really we we're, were asking for the same effort and the same intensity, I, mean, I was incredibly proud of the Performance last week and going back and reviewing, you, you, you can't you can't question that commitment and that effort. And you know, unfortunately, there's been a bounce of the ball and a couple of kicks that uh, you know the All Blacks have managed to um, uh, use to to get an advantage from, and 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 that's the way the rugby game goes. But in terms of uh, that effort and that uh, resolve and desire last week, it was fantastic, and we need to repeat that again this week.